Okay. Just quickly save again. Okay. So we just got a code. Now it said the George guy was the father of American law. So I think someone up here, their book said that. Uh, Andrew Robinson? No, I can't get into that one. Let's see. Trash cans are flowing. Times are changing. Our law, existing laws are no use anymore. Surfass the father of our law. So yeah. Oh, what was the code? Uh, 1647, I think it was? Maybe? Yes, okay. <clears throat> the only thing I remember was Mar... Oh! <laughs> I think I know what you're talking about, Rochelle. <laughs> oh, man. Contain the key to the lecture hallway. Okay, so I got a new key. Good. Uh, let's see. Got something new, so let's save again. Whoa! Ah! What? Oh, crap. Why? Why is it here? Back in the hotel, I... I thought I killed it. Oh, uh, it looks pissed off. Damn it. I'll think about it later. G gotta run. Okay, okay. Every other time something's been in the room. Uh, uh, no. Trash can. No. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Okay, okay. Hold on. Lock bo boxes, no. Book stuff, no. No, no, no. Jeez, that music. Wait a minute. There's John Keats' room tag. I'm in John Keats' room. I think I know what to do. Okay. Come here. Okay. And... Uh, yeah. Aha! Surely that'll keep it in. Whew. Uh-huh. But this is so bizarre. I mean, back at the hotel... And the hotel is hours away, isn't it? Could it really be following me? Why? How? Damn it. This is making me nuts. Or am I already going crazy? Am I just hallucinating this thing? Maybe. That's possibly what was happening in Paranoiac. Then again, it did attack Sissy. So it can't be my imagination. It exists. Monster that it is. D. If that monster's here, I have to warn D. Tell him he's got to get out of here. Okay. I was wondering earlier why the heck they gave me the key to an open room. Ah. All makes sense now. <laughs> Well, what the heck? I was only going to go to my... Then the, the hands jump-scared you, huh, Rochelle? <laughs> yeah, they caught me by surprise there, too, honestly. Uh, okay, what did I get? Crowbar. Lecture hallway key. Okay, while I'm up here, though, I can do one other thing. No, it wasn't here. Here. No, wait, this isn't it. Where was it? No. Is it down? No. It's like the game was speaking to me saying, You will not... <laughs> like the game was speaking to you, you will not be going anywhere. You'll be staying at this stream. You will stay with this stream forever and ever. <laughs> what? Wait a minute. Did I? Okay, I went downstairs, right? No, I didn't. I'm an idiot. Okay. Aha! There it is. That's what I'm looking for. Box of tools. Whole box too, too heavy to take. I can probably take two tools. So I had the screwdriver, 
used it. I probably don't need it again. Crowbar and a hammer. I'll come back if I need anything else. Okay. So, reference hallway. Where was that? about necessary deep fissure in the wall behind the eastern bookshelves basement storehouse repairs needed no that's the infirmary Ooh. aha here we go lecture hallway let's save again because you need to save frequently what? Friends, faculty, and staff, I thank you for coming today. Today is, for us, the best day of our lives. Because today, we leave the nest of our school and begin our climb to adulthood. Those who passed the bar exam, those who didn't, those becoming clerks or, notari nor bleh, or notaries or teachers. All of us will be graduating from this school and we owe a great debt to it. Though even if they manage to graduate, some of us may need to put a little more time into their studies. <laughs> uh-huh. But these graduates have one thing in common. They're filled with hope for their future. They're ready to challenge what lies ahead. A toast to our dreams, to our yet unsure futures. And may we have God's grace. That's actually quite lovely. And thank you so much for tweeting out about the stream, Rochelle. D. How did you get into this lecture room? Wasn't the hallway locked? Eh? You forget I'm a graduate here? I know all the secret ways, dummy. Huh. Well... What were you listening to? A tape? Yeah, for my graduation day. Man, has it really been three years? I was getting nostalgic for the place, and even abandoned, it really hasn't changed. It's just like it was when I was taking classes. Huh. Studying was wearing me out, so I came here for a breather. It's nice to have places full of memories like this. Huh. You graduated, but you're still studying? Hey, lay off. Yeah, I couldn't pass the bar exam. Uh, all right. So I'm cramming at home now. Next up's going to be my sixth attempt. Huh. There were lots of great guys in my class. Most of them passed it in one shot. Being a lawyer has been my dream since I was a kid, so I was so happy when I got accepted here. Felt I was one step closer to making it come true. The work was rough, and I just barely managed to graduate. I think it's my kind, helpful professors that did it. Hmm. I'll pass next time for sure. I mean, it's my sixth time. Any more and I'll be way behind my classmates. Well, it's good to be motivated, but it's dangerous here. You should get out of here soon. Huh? Dangerous? What? It's sort of hard to explain. There's kind of a monster here. It'll attack you if it finds you. I thought you were just some weird old guy wandering an abandoned school, but... Damn, you really are nuts, huh? Seriously, a monster? Even little girls don't believe that stuff. You're being a total doofus. Really? Okay, D. <clears throat> Do you enjoy making fun of people? And I don't think I'm much older than... Ahem. Don't quarrel with me, alright? I'm a talented soon-to-be lawyer. You'd be no match for me. Uh-huh. Look, I know the law process is partially about debate, but you don't seem to be that good at it. Ugh, do what you want, but don't say I didn't warn you. 
Yeah, I will do what I like. Thanks. Like I need a shady punk like you telling me what to do around my alma mater. Jeez, what a... <sighs> hey, Paul. What? I... I got in. W what? Really? You got in? To flight school? Okay. That's crazy. David, I can't even do a handstand. You can do whatever you put your mind to. <laughs> Thanks. But it doesn't make me a pilot yet. Still have to pass the exam. Man, dude, you totally will be. And make sure you, to give me a ride. I'd love to fly above the city sometime. Paul, I'm not going to fly passenger planes. It's not that kind of school. Don't sweat the details. I'm glad for you. You did good. Hey, I'll take you to lunch today. Huh. Back then, I wasn't really thinking. I was just going wherever I wanted. I wonder if D is like that. Huh. Yeah, Rochelle, uh, that guy is a... Uh, yeah. He does sound like a right little something. I'm gonna say D sounds like a right little D. The Julius Stone School newspaper is posted up. Julius Stone Low Specials... L Julius Stone Law Special School. Weak Hot Topics. A big hand for Michelle. Today we must pay tribute to Michelle Statham. Well, that's a famous last name. Wrote a dissertation Inserted an ad in scholarly book, Regal Collection, will be a great achievement of, and he make a great contribution to a contribution in our school. He's in Professor Cindy Peterson's class, majoring in global jurisprudence. Michelle Statham, birthday 619. Okay. 619. Right, Cindy said that he had the same birth. They had the same birthday, and that's her code. So six nineteen. Uh, Cindy's room. Cindy's room. Is that here? Cindy. Yep. Okay. Let me just save again. Security box requires passcode. Okay. So zero six. 19. Yes, Rochelle. Twitch did blank it out, but I, I kind of got the gist of what you were saying. It contained the key to the lecture rooms. Okay. So I have the lecture room key now. Lecture rooms. Where are the lecture rooms? Uh, let me see. Lecture rooms. Is that... No, wait a minute. I opened the lecture hallway, so... I mean, the lecture room should be here, right? So I was in this one. Keyhole's painted over. It won't open. Aha! Here we go. Okay, so piece of paper on the floor, lined with reference books, notice about a seminar, 921, in the auditorium, Crime Among the Impoverished and Its Prevention. Ivan Abelitsev's Criminal Behavior, a Psychological Approach, will be referenced, so be sure to read it before coming. Professor of Criminology, Franz Moore. Franz Moore. Is he the guy that left a his code in a book, possibly? I think it, I think he is. I'll have to double check that. Okay, let me just save again. Okay, what do we got here? Scrap from a notebook. I knew there was something I lacked, but I didn't want to admit it. My ambitious youthful youthfulness wouldn't let me. I wanted someone to say it. 
I wanted to be woken up, to be told I'm a have-not. Lacking. I have not. It's true. There are haves and have-nots. People whose dreams can come true, and... Oh! Uh, again! Sometimes my head just starts hurting bad. Wait, didn't his mother have like a... Finally, it... Oh! Uh, oh, uh, man. Behind you. Who? Yeah. Oh crap. Oh crap. Ah. Uh. D damn monster. Why are you chasing me? Get uh. Uh. Whoa. Did we die? Uh... 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 What? Why are we alive? I mean, I'm not complaining, but... I'm... I'm alive? The monster's gone. I thought it would kill me, but it left? Damn it. Ugh. My neck hurts. I feel so sluggish. I haven't really slept since yesterday. I should try to rest somewhere. Rests? Whoa, okay, yeah, we are moving slow. Uh, let me just... Whoa! 20 out of 100 HP. Okay. We are hurt. Try to rest somewhere. Where the heck can we rest? Uh, was there a um, place to lie down or a bed? Maybe a couch? Men's room. No. No. Maybe here? Couch? No. Oh, infirmary. Yeah, there are beds here. Can I... Well, maybe some medicine? No. Uh... Rest? Aha! I'll take a little nap. Pushing myself wouldn't be a good idea. Uh, I feel a lot better. All right, let's go. Aha! We're back to full speed. Okay, good. Okay. Oh, we're at half health, though. Okay. Save again. Let's get moving. Um, let me think here. Where should we be going? Uh, what did we get? Cigarettes, cell phone. Uh... Right, I need to check uh, Franz Moore's. Yep, Franz Moore. Okay, because I think he's the one. Lost note in my security box password, thus I couldn't get into the computer room. Thought I had it when I was writing for a seminar in the reference room. Maybe I left it in a book somehow. I should go look. Okay. Holy crap. A reference room. Is that here? Okay, here we go. Books on international law, international law, international law, criminology. Criminal behavior, a psychological approach. That notice in the lecture room mentioned this. I don't understand a word of it. Hmm? There's a slip of paper in here. What's the number 9981 for? 
Bingo. Okay. We are... This is all moving along pretty smoothly. I mean, once you get the hang of this, like... I mean, it's basically one clue that leads to another clue that leads to another clue, so... Security box that requires a passcode. 9981. Contain the key to the computer room. Okay. So where's the computer room? Ray Twain. Cindy Peterson. Andrew Robinson. Okay, so it has to be downstairs. So Rochelle, Matsuri, what, what do you, uh... What do you think of this so far? The Crooked Man. Reference room. Computer room. Okay. Uh, let's save again. Oh, jeez. Well, welcome back, Rochelle. I'm sorry your rabbit decided to troll you. Unlock computer room. Okay, we're in. Computer doesn't have power. Computer doesn't have power. Laptop computer knows pa there's no power. Okay, so here's where we need something. It's glowing. Okay. Save. Okay. So, okay, I'll take another quick little break here. Just to take another little drink. Converse a bit with my stream. <laughs> Just, we'll be back momentarily.